What's up guys, we are back here in our main account, level 91 now, and we have currently maxed out all of the spells that we are using. Swordwain is at level 14 as you can see there, with a .5 stun power. We have the shield spell, maxed out at level 13, with that slight regeneration on there, 5,281 shield and then we have Sonic Blast, maxed out level 10, 10,000 blunt damage there. With a little bit on the range and the cooldown decreased. So let's jump into some raids here, show you the attacking setup, what we've been doing. And uh, sadly it looks like it's still lagging a little bit. Now the Wi-Fi isn't doing so hot. Let's pause this. Alright, let's see if that helped out there. Gonna go, we're needing uh, gold right now. We actually have three workers available. And it's still not working. Wi-Fi, come on. Come on, Wi-Fi. So the, uh, yeah, the video's gonna be very laggy. Oh, it, it, it's working. So slow. 368,000. I'm going to pass over that one. 425. Oh, it's, it's working. Wi-Fi. All right, let's go. Since it's working, I'll still rate here at 409. We are typically looking for higher gold value than this. Uh, but 400, we'll just make do. So one of these little monks here. And then just a few archers has been my go-to setup. And then non-stop night spam. So at this point, the monk is level 4. You see the shields maxed out. So we have a ton of life on our troops. The sword ring can almost one-shot elite boosted cannons, which is pretty cool. Oh, and we didn't kick enough bombs back there. Oh, so a mistake there. We should have kicked some of those bombs back to keep our monk alive. Let's see, so let's bring out another monk. Take all that stuff down, bring out some more archers. Gotta kick those bombs back. I uh, can't, can't not do that. That is uh, very, very costly. And again, it killed our monk. We have a sizable army. It should be fairly easy to go through the base now. Sword and finishes off all the ogres, and we just have to deal with these wolves. Sonic Blast there. And yeah, it looks like we have no problems whatsoever taking down this base. whole lot of time left on the clock so at this point we are again just waiting for our archers to uh, clean up the remaining stuff we're gonna run back here see fingers crossed yep 100 percent good stuff so even though our monk died we still took care of that base with a lot of time left over we're gonna go attack some uh higher ranking bases i think let's go look into our favorites list and see who we have here that will hopefully give us a challenge and give us a lot of gold. So let's try a 4600 base. Here we go. Wow. 773 and 771 medals. Hopefully he's not online right now. Lots of snake towers and cannons. So I think at this point it would be a ton of night spam. Yeah. 
All right, so tons of night spam. I don't think I really need any archers. Those there. Sonic Blast has finished those guys off. So actually, it looks like we definitely needed archers. At this point, we've probably messed up too much. We have to sit back, wait, recover. Bring out archers. Because this is going to be way too much damage for us. Yeah, way too much damage. So we definitely messed up there. We needed a little bit of archers to pick off some of those cannons in the beginning. But otherwise, I think that is definitely doable. Let's give that one another shot here. Hugo Chen. Good job. Wrecked us. Too many cannons. We built that that choke point up because we didn't kill any of those guys. Ah, the loot dropped down from 700 to 500. Alright, so let's bring out some archers. This time we have a little bit, and then we're going to sword rain over there. So shield spell there. Oh, nope, that's not working either. Alright, we're going to hold back. Kind of keep our monk here. The question is, do we have enough time now to get through the base? We wasted a lot of time. Good news is we still have a monk alive back there. That's going to be very important. Yeah, so this monk will be extremely important, keeping all our knights alive right here. Because the cannons are going to blow through that shield spell. It's going to come very, very close, guys. We might have a shot at beating this. Mainly thanks to that monk, if... We have enough for one Sonic Blast. Stay right here in the middle, kill these troops. I think we got it down, yes! Oh yeah, so we missed a couple towers. But definitely took it down. 700 metal base. Wowza, 751. Ton of metals. And we got lucky and picked up a nice earring. Or ring. Melt that down for some pearls. Let's see who else we can take down here. Let's go up here to a 
811 metal base here, 4,700 trophies, lots of ogres. Got a small amount of gold, but we're here for the challenge. Can we take this guy's base down? All right, let's see here. So a couple of archers here and there. He's starting off with the ogres. What's a great spot for our sword? And we're going to be able to kill two waves of ogres. We got that scream going on there. Going to run back and sword rain those guys. Shield up the back units. And then now rush up to our frontline squad. Oh, we need to make sure our monk stays alive. That is critical. Monks got to stay alive. So again, got to make sure our monk stays alive there. Kept the monk alive. It's great. Got up here to the other side of the choke point. And we're going to come out of the corner there and shield those guys up. Popped out another monk. And now nonstop knights. As we're kind of solo Rambo style on it now. Since our troops are uh, kind of nowhere to be found. We've left them in the dust. Holding on our sonic blast till we get into this corner here. Now our reinforcements have arrived. Need to take those guys down with the sword right there. And we have a huge army. We're unable to hit the castle gate with our sonic blast there. But it's not going to matter. We have enough troops now to finish off. And we have another sonic blast here. So we didn't get 100%. But we did take the base down. Massive amount of metals. Over 700 there. 786. Pretty insane right here. Let's keep moving on up in the friends list. Or the favorites list and see if we have anyone that is maybe near 5,000 trophies that we can beat. All, right, all we have is we have Cindy Song at 5,500 here. The question is, can we take down a 5,500 metal base? Let's look and strategize this. It's got a lot of lightning tires. They are elite boosted. So I'm not sure how I feel about that. I personally hate the lightning towers. Uh, but maybe at this range, when he has elite boosts on them, this high level alliance, maybe this is actually effective. We'll find out here. We are going in, taking on this 5500 base. The cannons are going to be built up on that side there. And then that is just like murderer's row. Very few wolves. So I think we're going to have to go with a little bit of archers. A little bit of archers in the beginning here. And then we're going to go with some knights. And we're going to sword right to take care of a lot of those troops right there in the beginning. We're going to scream to bring them back, I think. I think this is what we want to do here. To kind of build up an army. Oh, and we just got toasted. So the how there, 
the ogre, the lightning tower, the spikes, just wrecked, wrecked house there. No question about it, we had to take care of those wolves. Uh, can't let a howling wolf ogre combination kill us there. So let's see, let's see. Uh, non stop knights? No, let's do non stop ogre, or non stop archers. Let's see if we can go that way. Non stop archers using the range. Maybe that will be a very effective attacking squad. So once again, we're non-stop archers at this point. Those bomb towers are doing a ton of damage though. See, so many bomb towers, we can't even really get out of the initial starting area the combination of the bomb towers and all these cannons all right so let's hold back up or start knights and we're going to try and bring them back to the tent so the cannons can run past us and move away from that choke point. We've wasted a lot of time, and oh man, that ogre has devoured all our knights. We're making a little bit of ground, and the, oh, that lightning tower did do a good chunk of damage to the king there. And that's as far as we got in that base right there. So 5,500 trophies cannot beat, can barely even get past the front door. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Check out some of the other videos and post in the comment section if you have any cool uh, bases that you want to maybe get tested. I might be going back and testing out some bases, so post down in the comment section. Cool bases, hard bases, challenging bases. Talk to you guys later.